I told you, I told you, I told you. Art movers, art movers, art movers. Welcome, welcome, welcome. I told you we was gonna be here six days a week. Welcome to the Ark of the Covenant Ministry, Mental and Physical Workout. Yay! Well, we're going to get a chance to work that body, move that arthritis, that rheumatism, that stiffness, that immobility, and put it on the throne of grace that now faith is the substance of things hoped for and the evidence of things not seen. Watching the Lord take what you have and watch him show up and show out with it. And we're going to saturate our mind by memorizing scriptures as we hide it in our heart so we might not sin against him as we meditate on it day and night. As we study it to show ourselves approved, need not be ashamed. A workman rightly dividing the word of truth so we can have an answer for the hope that we believe in. So the Holy Spirit can teach us so we can teach all nations because we know that there is no black, no white, no male, no female. No Jew, no Greek, no red man, no green man, no brown man. There is no Puerto Rican, no Spanish. There is no Baptist, no Church of God in Christ. There is no Jehovah Witness. There is no Southern Baptist, no, no Northern Baptist. There is no Protestants, no Catholics, not in the body of Christ, because we know there's only one God, one faith, one baptism, and we can go out and teach all nations and baptize them in the name of the Father, the Son, and the Holy Ghost. And we can tell how God has done for us year by year, month by month, day by day, moment by moment. If another can hear what God has done for us, they can say, if God did it for them, he can do it for me. And we know that we are his witnesses because we know that we know that we know our name is written in the Lamb's book of life. And we search the skies diligently for his return. Now, if you want to be a part of a diverse group of believers that stands on the word of God. Now, if you want to be a part of a body of believers that truly just want to spread the gospel of Jesus Christ all over this world, if you want to be a part of a believers that's excited about being a follower of Jesus Christ, then of course you can watch our videos on the Ark of the Covenant 2 channel on YouTube, or you can get the full effect of all of what we have to offer by downloading our app, which you can download only on your phone at www.ark, that's A-R-K, of the covenant, C-O-V-E-N-A-N-T, 
ministry, M-I-N-I-S-T-R-Y dot com. And you can go through one of the portals there, download it, and the best part about it is that it is free, free, free. And listen, all we ask for is your prayers. And with that, we can take it and spread the gospel of Jesus Christ all over the world. And hallelujah. Praise be to God. The building of the body of Christ can be a fantastic thing. So let us get started. Welcome to the art of the covenant ministry mental and physical workout where we is a 15 to 30 minute workout where we add one scripture a week one exercise a week this is week number 10 day number five where we hear six days a week now remember we practice safety 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 and if you cannot complete the exercise in full, don't worry about it. Don't beat yourself up. Just continue with the verse and catch in with the way you fit in. Listen, if you memorizing a different version of the Bible, that is okay, too. Remember, you can also use both extremities at the same time. It is okay. I'm building up to that by faith. By faith, we work it by faith in here. And remember, you can add as many repetitions as you like. You can do it as many times a day as you like. We suggest that you do it every couple of hours. The more you do it, the better it works for you. Remember, oh, also, we also got a floating question going on. Why do they call you art movers? And listen, we dropped a few nuggets on the way. What's inside the Ark of the Covenant was one. You can also meet with us on Saturdays at 10 a.m. here where we reading with Reverend Hill. We read it through the book, The Ark of the Covenant on the Moon, which would be added on our YouTube channel, Instagram, Facebook Live, even on our app. That Saturdays at 10 a.m. reading with Reverend Hill, reading from the book Ark of the Covenant on the Move. I think we on page like 107. The book only has 130 pages. We will be revealing why do they call us Ark Movers, as well as where he is the Ark of the Covenant today. So come on by. We also I use a little book to give myself a little more intensity to my workout. Now you can use the weights if you got some weights. If you don't, some people say they use canned goods. Others say they use a bottle after they drink the water out of it, add a little rice to it, and that's enough weight for them. Some say they use bags with can with different type of items in it that makes it enough weight for them. Others say they use heavy pillows. Some say they don't use a thing. But whatever you use, be safe, safe, safe with it. Also, remember that today at 10 a.m. is our Bible study day. Today is our Bible study. We in the Gospel of John chapter 3. So come on by 10 a.m. today. It'll be aired on our YouTube channel, on Instagram, and Facebook Live. 10 a.m. today is our Bible study. I believe we started at verse number 11. We go verse by verse, line by line, sometimes word by word, interpretation, application, and revelation of the word of God. Now, also at 2 p.m. is our prayer time. Come on by for prayer. From 2 to 2.30, we're having a great time. 2 to 2.30 is prayer time. Prayer time. Invite somebody. Would you come on by for prayer? It'd be on our YouTube channel, Instagram, as well as Facebook Live, and even on our app. So come on by. All right, now. Come now. We also have scriptures in the old and scriptures in the new. Our Old Testament scriptures come from created heaven and earth. The earth was without form and void, and darkness was upon the face of the earth. And the Spirit of God moved upon the face of the deep. And God said, Let there be light, and there was light. And God saw that the light was good. God divided light from darkness, and God called the light day and the darkness night. And the evening and the morning was the first day. 
And God said, let there be firmament, and the firmament divided the waters, and the waters from the waters. And God said, let the firmament divide the waters below from the waters above, and it was so. And God called the waters above heaven. God called the firmament above heaven. And the evening and the morning was the second day. And God gathered all the waters below together in the land of peace. And it was so. And God called all the earth below the land. And God called all the waters gathered below together seas. And it was good. Here we go now. In the beginning, God created heaven and earth. The earth was without form and void, and darkness was upon the face of the earth. And the Spirit of God moved upon the face of the deep. And God said, Let there be light, and there was light. And God saw that the light was good. God divided light from darkness, and God called the light day and the darkness night. And the evening and the morning was the first day. And God said, let there be firmament, and the firmament divided the waters, and the waters from the waters. And God said, let the firmament divide the waters below from the waters above, and it was so. And God called the waters above heaven, and God called the firmament above heaven. And the evening and the morning was the second day, and God gathered all the waters below together. And the land appeared, and it was so. And God called all the earth below the land. And God called all the waters gathered below seas, and it was good. In the beginning, God created heaven and earth. And the earth was without form and void, and darkness was upon the face of the earth. And the Spirit of God moved upon the face of the deep. And God said, let there be light, and there was light, and God saw that the light was good. God divided light from darkness, and God called the light day and the darkness night. And the evening and the morning was the first day. And God said, let there be firmament, and the firmament divided the waters, and the waters from the waters. And God said, let the firmament divide the waters below from the waters above, and it was so. And God called the waters above heaven. God called the firmament above heaven. And the evening and the morning was the second day. And God gathered all the waters below together. And the land appeared. And it was so. And God called all the earth below land. And God called all the waters gathered below sea. And it was good. In the beginning, God created heaven and earth. The earth was without form and void, and darkness was upon the face of the earth. And the Spirit of God moved upon the face of the deep. And God said, Let there be light, and there was light. And God saw that the light was good. And God divided light from darkness, and God called the light day and the darkness. And the evening and the morning was the first day. And God said, let there be firmament. And the firmament divided the waters and the waters from the waters. And God said, let the firmament divide the waters below from the waters above. And it was so. And God called the waters above heaven. And God called the firmament above heaven. And the evening and the morning was the second day. And God gathered all the waters below together, and the land appeared, and it was so. And God called all the earth below land, and God called all the waters gathered below seas, and it was good. All right, I'm switching over. I know some of you all was moving, using both hands, arms at the same time. That's okay. When I switch over, we switch over to our New Testament scriptures, which is found in the Gospel of John, chapter 1, verses 1 to 10, which is that so in the beginning was the Word. The Word was with God, and the Word was God. The same was in the beginning was with God. 
all things was created by him, and without him was anything made. In him is life, and that light is the light of men. The light shineth in darkness, and the darkness comprehended it not. There was a man sent of God, and his name was John. He came to bear witness, and he bare witness of the light, that through him all men might believe. He was not the light. He bare witness of the light that the true light might shine upon all men that came into the world. He was in the world. He created the world. But the world knew him not. All right, now here we go. In the beginning was the Word. The Word was with God, and the Word was God. The same was in the beginning was with God. All things was created by him, and without him was anything made. In him is life, and that light is the light of men. The light shineth in darkness, and the darkness comprehended it not. There was a man sent of God, and his name was John. He came to bear witness, and he bear witness of the light, that through him all men might believe. He was not the light, but he bear witness of the light, that the true light might shine upon all men that came into the world. He was in the world, he created the world, and the world knew him not. Amen. 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 Praise the Lord. Get your stretch on. Get your stretch on. Start low, come high. <laughs> In the beginning, God created heaven and earth. The earth was without form and void, and darkness was upon the face of the earth. And the Spirit of God moved upon the face of the deep. And God said, let there be light, and there was light. And God saw that the light was good. God divided light from darkness. God called the light day in the darkness night. In the morning and the evening was the first day. And God said, let there be firmament, and the firmament divided the waters, and the waters from the waters. And God said, let the firmament divide the waters below from the waters above, and it was so. And God called the waters above heaven. God called the firmament above heaven. And the evening and the morning was the second day. God gathered all the waters below together, and the land appeared, and it was so. And God called all the earth below land, and God called all the waters gathered together seeds, and it was good. In the beginning was the Word. The Word was with God, and the Word was God. The same was in the beginning, was with God. All things was created by him, and without him was anything made. In him is life, and that life is the light of man. The light shineth in darkness, and the darkness comprehended it not. There was a man sent of God, and his name was John. He came to bear witness, and he bear witness of the light, that through him all men might believe. He was not the light, but he bear witness of the light, that the true light 
light shine upon all men that came into the world. He was in the world. He created the world, but the world knew him not. All right. Here we go, y'all. We did our stretch, our next exercise. What well, is our next exercise? Here we did our stretch. I think our next exercise has been normal. Okay. There we go. Now, you can't let go the safety. Get, put a chair in front of you. You can get to the couch. You can get to a table. You can even get to a wall. But listen, be safe and practice safety, safety, safety. Now, if the chair is too low, just turn the chair around. <clears throat> and there you go. Practice and safety, safety, safety. But we're going to get on down. I'm gonna get on down to this crowd. I'm gonna touch it and try to squeeze this belly. So now listen, we're gonna do it nice and slow. We're not gonna jerk nothing, tear nothing, bend nothing, or twist nothing. Here we go. Old Testament, New Testament. Here we go. In the beginning, God created heaven and earth. The earth was without form and void, and darkness was upon the face of the earth. And the Spirit of God moved upon the face of the deep and god said let there be light if there was light and god saw that the light was good and god divided light from darkness and god called the light day and the darkness night and the evening and the morning was the first day and god said let there be firmament and the firmament divided the waters and the waters from the waters and God said, let the firmament divide the waters below from the waters above, and it was so. And God called the waters above heaven, and God called the firmament above heaven. And the evening and the morning was the second day. And God gathered all the waters below together, and the land appeared, and it was so. And God called all the earth below land. And God called all the waters gathered below seas. And it was good. In the beginning was the Word. The Word was with God, and the Word was God. The same was in the beginning was with God. All things was created by Him. And without Him was anything made. <clears throat> in him is life, and that light is the light of men. The light shineth in darkness, and the darkness comprehended it not. There was a man sent of God, and his name was John. He came to bear witness, and he bear witness of the light, that through him all men might believe. He was not the light. He bare witness of the light, that the true light might shine upon all men that came into the world. He was in the world. He created the world, and the world knew him not. Praise the Lord. Praise the Lord. Praise the Lord. Now, <clears throat> We're down to the legs. Now, if you cannot hold your legs up this long, listen, don't get frustrated, don't get mad. Put them down, keep on saying the verses, and pick them back up when you can. If you memorize in a different script, a uh, verse of the Bible, that's okay too. If you make a mistake, don't get mad, don't get frustrated, don't quit. Just come on and pick up the verse when you can and keep right on going. <coughs> Excuse me. Now, what we're going to do is we're going to pick up this right leg, we're going to stick it straight out, and we're going to say the Old Testament scripture. We're going to point it to the right. We're going to repeat the Old Testament scriptures again. We're going to bring it back and point it straight out. We're going to repeat the Old Testament scriptures again. We're going to draw this leg up to my chest, and we're going to say the Old Testament scriptures again. 
in, and we're going to put it down on the ground. Then we're going to get over here to the left and pick up the left leg, and then we're going to point it straight out. We're going to say the New Testament scripture. Then we're going to point it to the left. We're going to say the New Testament scripture. In. Then we're going to bring it back and point it straight out. We're going to say the New Testament scriptures again. We're going to draw it up to my chest. We're going to say the New Testament scriptures again. We're going to put it down on the ground. Then we're going to pick them both up together. We're going to point it to the right. We're going to say the Old Testament scriptures. We're going to point it to the left and say the New Testament scriptures. Then we're going to put it down on the ground. And that's it. All right. Our moves. Here we go. <laughs> Whee! Genesis chapter 1, verses 1 to 10. In the beginning, God created heaven and earth. The earth was without form and void, and darkness was upon the face of the earth. And the Spirit of God moved upon the face of the deep. And God said, Let there be light, and there was light. And God saw that the light was good. And God divided light from darkness, and God called the light day and the darkness night. And the evening and the morning was the first day. And God said, Let there be firmament, and the firmament divided the waters, and the waters from the waters. And God said, Let the firmament divide the waters below from the waters above. And it was so. And God called the waters above heaven. God called the firmament above heaven. And the evening and the morning was the second day. And God gathered all the waters below together. And the land appeared, and it was so. And God called all the earth below land. And God called all the waters gathered together below seas, and it was good. In the beginning, God created heaven and earth, and the earth was without form and void, and darkness was upon the face of the earth. And the Spirit of God moved upon the face of the deep. And God said, Let there be light, and there was light. God saw that the light was good. God divided light from darkness, and God called the light day of the darkness night. And the evening and the morning was the second, first day. And God said, let there be a firmament, and the firmament divided the waters, and the waters from the waters. And God said, let the firmament divide the waters below from the waters above, and it was so. And God, <coughs> excuse me, and God called the waters above heaven. And God called the firmament above heaven. And the evening and the morning was the second day. And God called all the waters below together in the land of peace. And it was so. And God called all the earth below the land. And God called all the waters gathered together seas. And it was good. In the beginning, God created heaven and earth. And the earth was without form and void, and darkness was upon the face of the earth. And the Spirit of God moved upon the face of the deep. And God said, Let there be light, and there was light. And God saw that the light was good, and God divided light from darkness. And God called the light day and the darkness night. And the evening and the morning was the first day. And God said, let there be firmament, and the firmament divided the waters, and the waters from the waters. And God said, let the firmament divide the waters below from the waters above, and it was so. And God called the waters above heaven, and God called the firmament above heaven. And the evening and the morning was the second day. And God gathered all the waters below together in the land. And it was so. And God called all the earth below man. And God called all the waters gathered together seas. And it was good. In the beginning, God created heaven and earth. And the earth was without form and void. And darkness was upon the face of the earth. And the Spirit of God moved upon the face of the deep. And God said let there be light and there was light and god saw that the light was good god divided light from darkness and god called the light day and darkness night and the evening and the morning was the first day and god said let there be firmament and a firmament divided the waters and the waters from the waters and god said 
let the firmament divide the waters below from the waters above, and it was so. And God called the waters above heaven. God called the firmament above heaven. And the evening and the morning was the second day. And God called all the waters below together and the land of Eden. And it was so. And God called all the earth below land. And God called all the waters gathered together seas. And it was good. All right. Here we go, y'all. In the beginning, John chapter 1, verses 1 to 10. In the beginning, God was the Word. The Word was with God, and the Word was God. The same was in the beginning, was with God. All things was created by him, and without him was anything made. In him is life, and that life is the light of men. The light shines in darkness, and the darkness comprehended it not. There was a man sent of God, and his name was John. He came to bear witness, and he bare witness of the light, that the true light might, no, he was not the light, but he bare witness of the light, that the true light might shine upon all men that came into the world. He was in the world. He created the world, but the world knew him not. In the beginning was the Word. The Word was with God, and the Word was God. The same was in the beginning was with God. All things was created by Him, and without Him was anything made. In Him is life, and that life is the light of men. The light shineth in darkness, and the darkness comprehended it not. There was a man sent of God, and his name was John. He came to bear witness, and he bare witness of the light, that through him all men might believe. He was not the light, but he bare witness of the light that the true light might shine upon all men that came into the world. He was in the world. He created the world, but the world knew him not. In the beginning was the Word. The Word was with God, and the Word was God. The same was in the beginning was with God. All things was created by him. And without him was anything made. In him is life. And that life is the light of men. The light shines in darkness. And the darkness comprehended it not. There was a man sent of God. And his name was John. He came to bear witness, and he bare witness of the light, that the true, he was not the light, but he bare witness of the light, that the true light might shine upon all men that came into the world. He was in the world. He created the world, and the world knew him not. In the beginning was the Word. The Word was with God, and the Word was God. The same was in the beginning was with God. All things was created by Him, and without Him was anything made. In Him is life, and that life is the light of men. The light shineth in darkness, and the darkness comprehended it not. There was a man sent of God, and his name was 
John, he came to bear witness, and he bear witness of the light. That through him all men might believe. He was not the light, but he bare witness of the light, that the true light might shine upon all men that came into the world. He was in the world, he created the world, and the world knew him not. All right, y'all. In the beginning, God created heaven and earth. The earth was without form and void, and darkness was upon the face of the earth. And the Spirit of God moved upon the face of the deep. And God said, Let there be light, and there was light. And God saw that the light was good. God divided light from darkness, and God called the light day and the darkness night. And the evening and the morning was the first day. And God said, let there be firmament. And the firmament divided the waters and the waters from the waters. And God said, let the firmament divide the waters below from the waters above. And it was so. And God called the waters above heaven. And God called the firmament above heaven. And the evening and the morning was the second day. And God gathered all the waters below together in the land of Peter. And it was so. And God called all the earth below land. And God called all the waters gathered together seas. And it was good. In the beginning was the word. The Word was with God, and the Word was God. The same was in the beginning was with God. All things was created by Him, and without Him was anything made. In Him is life, and that life is the light of men. The light shineth in darkness. And the darkness comprehended it not. There was a man, son of God, and his name was John. He came to bear witness, and he bear witness of the light. That all men, that through him all men might believe. He was not the light. But he bear witness of the light, that the true light might shine upon all men that came into the world. He was in the world. He created the world, and the world knew him not. Amen. Praise the Lord. Praise the Lord. Hallelujah. Okay. Here we go now. We got another minute of the exercise. Now, if you don't, you can use the chair, the couch, the table, or the wall. Now, you can do it with one arm, or you can do it with two. Here we go. I like to do nine with two. We're going to do it nice and slow. We ain't going to try to pull nothing, break nothing, shake nothing loose. Here we go. In the beginning, God created heaven and earth. The earth was without form and void. And darkness was upon the face of the earth. And the Spirit of God moved upon the face of the deep. And God said, Let there be light, and there was light. And God saw that the light was good, and God called, divided light from darkness. God called the light day in the darkness night. And the morning and the evening was the first day. And God said, Let there be firmament. And the firmament divided the waters, and the waters from the waters. And God said, Let the firmament divide 
the water below from the waters above, and it was so. And God said, Call the evening the morning for the second day. And God called all the water below together, and the land appeared, and it was so. And God called all the earth below man. And God called all the water together below seas, and it was good. In the beginning was the Word. The Word was with God, and the Word was God. The same was in the beginning was with God. All things was created by Him, and without Him was anything made. In Him is life. And that light is the light of men. The light shining in darkness. And the darkness comprehended it not. There was a man sent of God, and his name was John. He came to bear witness, and he bear witness of the light that through him all men might believe. He was not the light, but he bear witness of the light. That the true light might shine. He was in the world. He created the world. But the world knew him not. Amen. 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 Praise the Lord. All right. All we're going to do is bring the knee up to the hand. We repeat, knee up to the hand. In the beginning, God created heaven and earth. The earth was without form and void. Darkness was upon the face of the earth, and the Spirit of God moved upon the face of the deep. And God said, Let there be light, and there was light. And God saw that the light was good. And God divided light from darkness, and God called the light day and darkness night. And the evening and the morning was the first day. And God said, let there be firmament, and the firmament divided the waters, and the waters from the waters. And God said, let the firmament divide the waters below from the waters above, and it was so. And God called the waters above heaven, and God called the firmament above heaven. And the evening and the morning was the second day. And God gathered all the waters below together, and the land appeared, and it was so. And God called all the earth below man, and God called all the waters gathered below seas, and it was good. All right. In the beginning was the word. The Word was with God, and the Word was God. The same was in the beginning was with God. All things was created by Him, and without Him was anything made. In Him is life, and that light is the light of men. The light shines in darkness, and the darkness comprehends it not. There was a man sent of God and his name was John he came to bear witness and he bear witness of the light that through him all men might believe he was not the light he bear witness of the light that the true light might shine upon all men that came into the world he was in the world. He created the world. And the world knew him not. Amen. Amen. Here we go. Small service. In the beginning, God created heaven and earth. The earth was without form and void, and darkness was upon the face of the earth. 
And the Spirit of God moved upon the face of the deep. And God said, Let there be light, and there was light. And God saw that the light was good. God divided light from darkness, and God called the light day and the darkness night. And the morning of the evening was the first day. And God said, let there be firmament, and the firmament divided the waters, and the waters from the waters. And God said, let the firmament divide the waters below from the waters above, and it was so. And God called the waters above heaven, and God called the firmament above heaven. And the evening and the morning was the second day, and God called all the waters below together. And the land appeared, and it was so. And God called, God called all the earth below land. And God called all the waters gathered below seas. And it was good. All right. Here we go. In the beginning was the Word. The Word was with God, and the Word was God. The same was in the beginning was with God. All things was created by him, and without him was anything made. In him is life, and that life is the light of men. The light shines in darkness, and the darkness comprehended it not. There was a man sent of God. And his name was John. He came to bear witness, and he bear witness of the light. That through him all men might believe. He was not the light. He bear witness of the light. That the true light might shine upon all men that came into the world. He was in the world. He created the world, but the world knew him not. All right. Here we go. Here we go, y'all. Elbow to opposite knee. In the beginning, God created heaven and earth. The earth was without form and void. Darkness was upon the face of the deer. And God said, Let there be light, and there was light. And God saw that the light was good. And God divided light from darkness, and God called the light day and darkness night. And the evening and the morning was the first day. And God said, Let there be firmament. And the firmament divided the waters, and the waters from the waters. And God said, let the firmament divide the waters below from the waters above, and it was so. And God called the waters above heaven. And God called the firmament above heaven. In the evening and the morning was the second day. And God gathered all the waters below together, and the man appeared. And it was so. And God called all the earth below land. And God called all the waters gathered below seas. And it was good. Amen. Here we go. In the beginning was the word. The word was with God. And the word was God. The same was in the beginning was with God. All things was created by him. And without him was anything made. In him is life. And that life is the light of man. The light shines in darkness. And the darkness comprehends in not. There was a man sent of God, and his name was John. He came to bear witness, 
the bad witness of the light, that through him all men might believe. He was not the light, but he bear witness of the light, that the true light might shine upon all men that came into the world. He was in the world. He created the world. But the world knew him not. All right. Here we go. Got a new exercise for the week. I'd like to be more than this one, y'all. All right. Got to weave and bob, weave and bob. In the beginning, God created heaven and earth. The earth was without form and void, and darkness was upon the face of the earth, and the Spirit of God moved upon the face of the deep. And God said, Let there be light. There was light. And God saw that the light was good. God divided light from darkness, and God called the light day and the darkness night, and was born it, and the evening was the first day, and God said, let there be firmament, and the firmament divided the waters, and the waters from the waters, and God said, let the firmament divide the waters below from the waters above, and it was so, and God called the waters above heaven. And God called the firmament above heaven. And the evening and the morning was the second day. God called all the waters below together and the land appeared and it was so. And God called all the earth below man. And God called all the waters gathered together sea and it was good. In the beginning was the Word. The Word was with God, and the Word was God. The same was in the beginning was with God. All things was created by Him, and without Him was anything made. In Him is life, and that life is the life of men. The life shineth in darkness, and the darkness comprehended it not. There was a man sent of God, and his name was John. He came to bear witness, and he bear witness of the light, that through him all men might believe. He was not the light, but he bear witness of the light that the true light might shine upon all men that came into the world. He was in the world. He created the world. But the world knew him not. Amen. Praise the Lord. Hallelujah. Praise the Lord. It's always good to get your prayer on. Hey, come out here and get me a workout on with my friends. Praise the Lord. God is good. Always, always, always. Well, remember today is our Bible study, Gospel of John, chapter 3, starting at verse 11. At 10 a.m., we'll be airing it on, on our uh, YouTube channel on Instagram, on our Facebook Live, also on the app at 10 a.m. this morning. Prayer time at 2 to 2.30 this, uh, this afternoon on our YouTube channel, Instagram, and on the app also on Facebook Live at 2 o'clock to 2.30. Uh, remember Saturday at 10 a.m. reading with Reverend Hill, reading with Reverend Hill, uh, 
reading from the Ark of the Covenant on the Move. We're on page 107. You only have 130 pages to go. We're dropping spiritual nuggets, trying to get y'all to the moment of the big revealing. Why do they call us Ark Movers? And where is the Ark of the Covenant? Saturday, uh, Sunday's message will be uh, a Sunday message will be from uh, let me see here. Let me get it to y'all real fast. I don't want y'all to miss this Sunday's message. It will be a great message Sunday. I don't want to misquote it. I want y'all to have the message. Uh, that's our Bible study. Sunday's message. It's going to be Hold on. I know all of this ain't it. I'm getting there, y'all. I'm getting there. Y'all just bear with me a minute here. I'm getting there. I'm getting there. Don't be fussing at me. Don't fuss at me. He spared. Okay. He spared not. And. He spared not. Hold on. I got to switch. I got to switch eye pieces. That's what the problem is. He spared not, and he spared not, it be better. He spared not, and it be better. <laughs> yeah, yeah, he spared not, and it be better. All right. So, and that, you know, we're going to be looking from 2 Peter chapter 2, verse 4. Second Peter chapter two, verse four. Father God, we thank you. Lord, we thank you for your, for the God here in our lives and for your word. And Lord, we thank you for your work out in Jesus name. Amen. Amen. Remember, be safe. Stay hydrated. I know we had a lot of information today. Bible study, 10 a.m., Reading with Reverend Hill Saturday at 10 a.m. And the message Sunday at 10 a.m. He spared not. It's better. It be better. And it be better. He spared not and it be better. Second Peter. Chapter 2, verse 4. <laughs> Have a great day. Remember prayer time too at 2 p.m. Bye bye now.